Hey guys, it is me, Richie101. Um, today I'm just gonna say pad info and pantry liner info. The reason why there's no tampons in here, cause I don't buy tampons cause I don't use them. But next year, if I still make these videos in the future, I'll be featuring tampons. If you're looking for a tampon video, I'm just gonna warn you right now, this is not a tampon video. Pat, what time you should change them. It really depends on your flow. If you have like a light flow, you can change them 4 to 5 hours. If you have a regular flow, 3 to 4 hours. If you have a heavy flow, 2 to 3 hours. Um, liners um, are usually for discharge. They're like mini pads. They look just like pads. Um, the liners are um, for discharge. You can change them anytime you want when you want to stay um, fresh. If you feel like you're self-conscious and you feel like you need to change your pad. I mean, you're panty liner then you, you can but there's no time there's not a certain there's not a certain time change for panty liners but sometimes when your discharge is heavy like mine you would like to change it more sooner you know so you don't get a vagina discharge or you don't get like something on them I'm going to show you how a pad looks like um This is a U by Cortex pad. Hope you can see it. Yeah, it's a U by Cortex pad. Um, not U by Cortex. My bad. Exit out. Rewind. This is a Cortex, just Cortex pad. Um, it's maxi. Look at how thick this is. It's very thick. Um, I wear these. These are maxi overnight. I wear these all night. Um, let me open it. This is just Cortex because there's a brand called U by Cortex. But there's also a brand just called Cortex. And this is how a pad looks like. Let me fix the camera. There. This is how a pad looks. Um, there's a part right here. This is the part that covers the sticky tongue. See? Very, very sticky. If you hear sounds, that's um my uncle. So I'll try to explain. This is how pads look like. Um, all pads come in different um shapes. So it's not just this. There's thinner ones, smaller ones, longer ones. Um, you would have to know your size and your flow to get the right one for you. Um, this is how a panty liner looks. This is a carefree panty liner with flowers very small it's not that big it's very small this is very thin i recommend you there's more pads out there i mean more panty liners out there like always ultra thin you buy cortex barely there you buy cortex barely there always thin there's a lot out there not just carefree but carefree is the best it's body shape it's anti-fresh um i love carefree and i love always thin too but Carefree is the best. It makes you stay fresh all the time. Um, I'm gonna show you how it looks like. It's just like a mini pad. It's the same thing, but smaller. And you can actually wear these with tampons for extra protection. You can um, and there's a sticky part. I like the sticky parts covered in flowers. If you can see, um. body shaped and it's very thin that's why i love it you can get these at walmart any they sell pads um um what was i gonna say oh yeah um there's others out there not just this um you can wear these for tampon backup for discharge or for lighter days they use panty liners for multiple things not just discharge some girls like to use it for tampons for don't do weeks um some girls like to use it on the light days because on the light days on the last day of their period their period might be very light and they just don't want to put a pad on just put a tampon i mean a panty liner um yeah and i think that's all i have on pads and liners and formation um so bye bye hope you like this peace